power. Power, but I know a lot of people who who trust in, who trust Jesus Christ. I know a lot of people who trust in Jesus. You know what I mean, you know what I'm saying? You probably talking about a that's the what that's the five percent. I know a lot of people who say they believe in Jesus Christ though. What's your point of saying? What's so you saying the few so you saying the few are defeating the masses. That's what it sounds like you're saying, because like I said, I know plenty of people who know Jesus, so it can't be that many Luciferians, because I don't even know any personally Luciferians. You don't I, think you know. You know, I'm, I'm not knocking that. So what you're saying is the Luciferians ain't out protest, like proclaiming their shit, so you don't know who they are. That's, is that what you're saying? Right, I don't know who they are. I can't sit here and say that I know who they are. If I was to see one, you wouldn't know. <clears throat> they don't just come out and say it. They they hide behind Christianity and all other religions and shit. Just like with the Masons, when you when you join Masonry, they allow you to have whatever religion that you want, but you gotta understand that that shit comes secondary. The Freemason doctrine comes first. So on the outside, you showing, you talking that Christian shit, but it's understood once you become a Mason that that shit comes secondary. You can say all that, you know, praise Jesus stuff, but the Masons understand just like you understand. That's just for show, because in your heart, you took the oath. This is what you believe. That makes sense. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I can, I can. I can understand what you're saying, especially when you say they're hiding behind it. Now, what does that matter? I don't know. Think for a minute, nigga. What does that mean to you? If you put, if you put your religion or what you proclaim to be, what you live for and live by, second to whatever they teaching, who who are you loyal to? The Freemason thing, man. Ain't none of shit makes sense. What about it? What are we talking about? You remember what the subject is? Yeah, the Luciferian. Is that the subject? That's what we're talking about. We're talking about. I'm gonna read it again. Who consciously chooses evil? Right. The Masons? You tell me, nigga. Just That's what I'm saying. I don't know, bro. After all that shit we just said, you I still don't, don't have no idea? I still don't know, have no idea, man. It's got to, it's, it, it, who, who do you want me to say? Who do you think? You can't ask a question you don't have an answer for yourself, bro. All I heard you say was Masons. That's all you heard? I mean, the Luciferian and the Mason and the way that they tell you that you have to put biblical text second. I say nothing about no biblical text. I say your belief. Your belief. Your belief. Religion. Put that second. Religion, you put that second. What that mean? What that mean? What? What, I just, what you just said. Religion? Yeah. I don't even subscribe to the religion. What, what you just said, what does that mean to you? Putting your religion second to this. That means the, the Masons are at the top. That's what they... That's what so they, what does that mean? Who are you loyal to? The Masons. That's what if you, you that's want what you're your saying. organization... That's what you're saying. And you agree... I'm telling you how the shit goes. I'm answering the question, man. 
Who, who consciously chooses evil? I'm answering that question. Okay, that's what I said. You saying the Mason, so I'm saying the Mason. That's who you're saying. I'm asking if, if that if, if that makes sense to you. What does that mean to you? <clears throat> Can you answer the question now? Who cho who consciously chooses evil? I'm asking you. Just from what we talked about this morning. I really don't know. People who do evil, man, that's all I can say. If that's, if that's got something to do with the the Masonic order, then yes, it would be the Masons. What do the Masons do? Yeah, you In your what opinion, saying? what do the Masons do? What is, what is it about? Order. In your, in your opinion, what is it? Order. Order. What does that mean? What do they do? I don't just, Nigga. What do I, Masons do? I don't know, personally. I you don't, don't know. You know what Masons stand for? I don't know. They do the knowledge. What do secret societies do? They do the knowledge. And? And that's... Tell me, bro. Why is it secret then? Why keep it secret? I'm, I'm telling you what I know. You asking me and I'm telling you what I know. What is the secret society secret for? Uh, obviously, they're hiding some knowledge. Some information. Wow. To, to continue to... Push their agenda. Why keep it secret? What's, 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 what's the benefit in keeping the knowledge secret? So everybody won't know it so they can be able to do it too. Pretty much. I mean, shit ain't that complicated, nigga. That's what I be saying. Connect the dots, nigga. Like, stop having me explain all this shit for you. You have, you have a, situ a situation where you claim to be a Christian. Why would somebody claim to be a Christian if they ain't? What's the benefits of claiming you're a Christian? Believe. There's people out there that, that call themselves social Christians. They just sound good. They get you acceptance into different groups. And If you're a family and you got a wife and shit and y'all Christian, they give people an idea of who you are as a person. That makes sense. Okay. Okay, what? Okay, I hear you. So that's why people claim Christians even when they ain't. When you look at it in the context of a, a Freemason thing, you, you join an organization. You are you you are loyal to the that organization's agenda. Whatever that organization is pushing, you loyal to that. In order to get a pass in society where people don't think twice, you claim to be Christian. Mm -hmm. People have an idea that, oh, he's a Christian, he must be a good person. You follow me? Right. So that's why they do it. That's why it's understood when you join these, these organizations, okay, you can have whatever religion you want as long as it's understood that that shit comes second to us. You loyal to us before you loyal to any of the other shit, including your family. You feel me? Hmm. That makes sense. You still with me, nigga? Yeah, I'm with you. So, in other words, they do it in order to gain your allegiance. Allegiance. Yeah. You're gonna have all these benefits from being in our group. When it comes time, we're gonna need you to do something. We're gonna need you to goddamn do it. No question that. Part of they then therein lies all the blood sacrifice shit. When people have to sacrifice their first child, or sacrifice certain people. There's certain things you gotta do to pay your fucking your dues in the motherfucking organization. You follow? I, I I follow you. I follow you. It's hard to take in. It's not hard to take in, but it brings me to another point about it. What's that? You see a lot of people real recently in the past years, 10, 15 years, have been denouncing Christianity. Mm -hmm. So is that a play against everything too? Yeah, you don't really know who, who pushing that shit, but it will make sense in the Luciferian thing. 
They want to defeat Christianity. They want to defeat it. After pushing, no. after pushing it so hard, now they damn denouncing it. After who pushed it? I mean, even though, I think even they push it. Who's they? Like you said, they 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 said just to get what they need, but yet it's still it's second. But they say to get it what they need, but then they gon' they gon' push it, but then denounce it at the same time. What? It's confusion. Push it, but denounce it at the same time. Left wing, right wing, same bird. I guess, man. I mean, you got different organizations. You don't really know whose true agenda is. Yeah, but everybody's in that. Everybody's saying Christian, but they don't even follow it. Like Who's you they? said. What you mean? Who? Whoever, Who whoever, Who, whoever, whoever's in the organization, whoever's in the that organization that you're talking about, which and they are probably all. Of the same bird, you see what I'm saying? They all of them still Mason, even though they might be, they might scream, they might scream BLM, Antifa, Q and Q and Q and on, and left wing, right wing, but yet still they're all Mason, saying Christianity. But then you want to denounce Christianity and talk shit. Up. You got some talking shit about Christianity. Some still saying, oh no, Christianity. You know. It's, I mean, you, you you even got uh, atheists out there too. They don't believe in nothing. That's not true. But, I mean, science. Mean you ain't fucking. You ain't proving to me that there's a god. They want they want proof. So you prove to me I ain't certain of that shit. So it's an empty, pretty empty proposition. We got agnostic. Agnostics are just still in search. There's a bunch of different little subgroups. That's what I'm saying. So, with that, with that being said, to turn to your question, but it's not like, not serving the God don't necessarily equal evil. Okay. People that don't necessarily serve God or want to believe in God are still moral people. Okay. I can I can relate. Is that, that that still causes confusion. All that still causes confusion. Cause now you're pitting everybody, it's, everybody's pitted against each other. Not necessarily. <laughs> in a civilized society, you can be whatever the fuck you want to be. You're not forced to do anything. Yeah, but you're people, forced to be people don't be civil. People. Everybody's not civil about it. What? Everybody's not civil about it. You got people pitting, pitting this no, group I'm, against I'm that group. I'm saying that's not how it have to be. Right. Just because people got different beliefs don't mean they have to clash. They can live in a civilized society and just do what they choose to do. Okay. So... Next question is overpopulation. Immigrants. You ain't, you ain't used to niggas calling you out on your bullshit, huh? Man, I don't, I don't give a fuck. Man. That's Cause I, you ain't answer the question. I still damn... You ain't answer the question, though. No, I, tell, I want people to tell me when I'm, if I'm wrong or something. I don't that care. Don't you know what I'm saying? Them. But that don't, that, don't change, that don't change how I feel if I feel strong about what I'm saying. Still answer the question. I'll have to. Huh? I don't have to answer that question. That's true. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's why I'm moving on. <laughs> Leave it alone. And move on to the immigrants. In my opinion, immigration is an issue for black people in America. Right. It's a big issue. Right. But it's another one of those issues that get thrown in the nigga face. <coughs> and it's so fucking insulting. It's so fucking absurd to tell a nigga who was either here when he got here or was brought here as slaves to just accept that the motherfuckers who live to the north and the south of us could just come freely and steal all the fucking jobs and, and fuck up the job market and, and, and lower wages and shit in the big picture 
Especially when you know that the motherfucking government and the corporations in America is in cahoots with this whole movement. Trump trying to damn stop it. Oh, man. Fuck out of here, man. I'm just saying, bro. Trump trying to stop it. Holler at me when somebody actually do stop it. Because it ain't that fucking hard. Probably why the damn school so overpopulated. What's your reason for making that a topic? Schools is overpopulated, man. Immigrants is coming in. Schools overpopulated. COVID nineteen running rampant. That's your reason for bringing it up. I'm just saying, bro. What's your reason for bringing it up as a topic, nigga? I'm just saying. I'm saying Trump trying to stop it. And you just not said it, taking jobs and shit, and Trump trying to stop it. So, would Donald Trump be a good choice? Would, would the Republicans be a good choice? Even in the local government. Because if they Republicans and they feeling Trump, then that is. So, you need to read, read the goddamn newspaper or do a, do a little traveling in your neighborhood, in your city. Yeah. That sounds real lazy fucking question uh, nah it's not it's not if you thinking about job, if you weren't if you weren't about job losses and stuff like that then it's not a lazy question it is. Trump trying to stop it the Democrats want Democrats that. is cool with it <clears throat> who say Trump ain't cool with it I mean cause he said he trying to stop it oh he trying, he trying to said, secure I'm the border. changed up what you said you what you said like four or five times, Trump trying to stop it. Trump trying to stop it. Uh -huh. Then you change it up to Trump say he trying to stop it. Yeah, yeah. So that, that's a big difference, ain't it? <coughs> that's a big fucking you difference. You asked me. And, and I said that's, that's why, because he said he trying to stop it. No, you say because he's stopping it. He's trying to stop it. That's different than he say he trying to stop it. Is it not? What well, I've been saying the whole time, Trump trying to stop it. Well, that's not what you just said. You said he said he's trying to stop it. Yeah, he said he's trying to stop it. Is that different? Him trying to stop it and him saying he's trying to stop it. Ain't that two different things? Do you, so hard, do you believe it or not? Do you believe it or not? Come on, man. We, man, we don't have to say simple points, man. I'm just it's not a simple point. point. It's not just a simple admit point. Just admit it when it is what it is. There's mm -hmm. a difference between saying he trying to stop it and he say he's trying. That's all I said, man. Just say, oh, yeah, there's a difference. It, you want to hear it, is, it is a difference. It's a difference. What he's saying is, do y'all understand that trying, saying trying to stop it, and he said he's trying to stop it, what he says doesn't exactly mean what he means. Okay, I understand that. What so I'm what saying... We're still talking about it 10 what minutes I, later. What I'm saying is, you don't... So, so, so you can't understand why people would even think that way, that Hey, Trump's trying to stop it. You don't understand why people would think that way? Maybe, and maybe they shouldn't think that way. If they don't think that way, and then the shit... That's why... I, but see, no, that's why don't. I say voting ain't worth a fuck, because nah, it's nah, best... Switch. Switch no, I'm not time. switching. I'm just saying. That's why I say voting ain't worth a fuck in order to keep your spirit, you know what I'm saying, intact and, and, and right. Because if you vote and what you don't get what you want, then you gonna feel some type of way, and that's how that's how this shit been going. Motherfuckers vote and don't get and, and shit don't change, and they like, damn. That ain't how we oh well, yeah. maybe we we'll get it the next time when we vote again for the same motherfucking damn bird. Because you trying to help the situation. What is you trying to do by doing the podcast? Just talking, talking, talk. So, if he's not trying to stop it, then what do you do? You don't know, really. Because he's saying he's, he is, but then he could be saying something that he's not even going to do or trying to do. So who the fuck do you vote for? The Democrats already said that they with it. They say they with it. They, they with what? With immigration. They cool with that shit. I don't think it's that simple, man. Nobody's cool with it necessarily. They use it as a fucking tool, just like they use everything else. They know immigrants, certain class of immigrants can vote, so they cater to those specific class of immigrants. 
where we fit in and we need to let where the fuck we stand. But we need to, as black people who came from the slaves. No, yeah. Come on, bro. No, you got off already, man. I understand what Kyle be coming from, man. It's hard, man. You make it hard, nigga. Shit. Pause. Huh. But, um, as black people who stuck in this motherfucker. Man. I don't even want to talk about this shit no more, man. Niggas, niggas out here talking all this conspiracy shit. This, this is what I'm about to say now. This talking all this conspiracy shit. I already know ain't a motherfucking thing changed. We know the same fucking cycle keep going on and on, and we still talking to we still talking to conspiracy shit. We already know what it is. We already know it's a conspiracy. So, so when niggas gonna stop talking about the shit and actually come together and do something about the shit? I mean, you don't, you don't what understand else? You, the shit. What else are you ain't got? Ain't nothing to understand besides coming together and damn walking in circles. You know what I'm saying? Coming together and walking make in something happen. Like what? Buy some land or something, man. How many times I got to tell people this, man? That's what I don't understand. You keep telling the same. You keep telling people. They keep saying the same shit. Who's they? People. People. Period. Black people. Keep saying the same shit over and over. You keep telling them the same shit over and over, and they never motherfucking damn do it. What and I'm talking, about I'm talking about gas on you. I'm talking about gas on you. Yeah, I'm talking about gas on you. And it's probably some you. other damn areas of black people that's going through the same thing. And I'm not saying that it's all black people because it's black people in other areas that probably are doing what needs doing to be doing. And who, who said I ain't doing it? Who said I am not doing it? You say this. I'm you, saying. You say this. I get up every morning going for shooting for the damn star. I get up every morning. I get up every morning. I tell shit, niggas man. about shit. And niggas never shit. come to the fucking table with nothing besides just talk like yo let's go let's go let's go see what we can get done if you build it they will come oh man this is ridiculous man you can't All speak right. it if you ain't doing it man i'm doing it i'm doing it and i say that i get up too. i get up yeah i'm not saying you're not you doing I, i'm you're saying doing. i can't say it if i ain't doing it but you are i can't blame nobody you for do, nothing you, if do, I, you do what you do i ain't doing enough but i'm saying i'm talking, enough Maybe. So I can't, I can't what's, just what's no enough? fucking buy What's enough? Buying land like you say. Okay, that's what I'm, that's what I'm talking about. If, if I could get, if we could get enough people to do the shit, we could probably get it done. That's we just got, right, we at least go try. We can go down. Who the fuck is we, nigga? The, <laughs> the people that I have talked to, let's say that. Why not you? Why not me? I'm one man. I'm one man, you, bro. You built it, they will come. I'm one man. You I'm there. already. I'm building. What do you mean? That's all I say. If we can go down here together what the fuck is we? as a unit, Who's we? people that I have talked to, that sound like it's just another reason so you can say the shit ain't happening. Cause we, cause we, right? We ain't. We ain't coming together and saying let's go down here. What happened to I? But you want me to tell you? How about, you want me to tell you a story? You want me to tell you a story? How about I when I'm blamed? You, you want me to tell you a story? We when you want, we successful. You want me to tell you that I? How about that? Let, let me, you want me to tell you that, that I? I'm not judging you, nigga. I I'm just saying. Have gone to the bank. I have gone talked to the to the banker about about about, about, about getting some about, some some listen, funding listen, listen, for listen, something. Listen, stop but talking, so why are you talking so much? For for no nah, cause cause I'm I'm explaining some shit. I, I don't need your explanation, man. I have went to the bank. What well, what about I? They when say it's they, they say we that it's, when we succeed. How about that? Let's, let's I try that. Blamed and we and we succeed. I succeed. When, it's, when when I'm blaming somebody, I blame I. But when we celebrating, it's we. Try that that, that little exercise. You can't celebrate we if we never get together. Well, then celebration is never spoke on. Then it's always I and the blame. It's always I to blame mm -hmm. because celebration never spoke upon. Uh, what's that? Is, what's that to celebrate if we ain't coming together? Then who fault is that? Sound like an I problem. How's that an I problem? Because I ain't making it happen. But if I was trying to make it happen, then it can't be a, it can't be an I problem. It's a, it's a we problem. 
Including I. Including I. That's where the, the that damn problem is at. That's where the, that's where the blame. No, no. Let's try Come to exercise. Come on, man. Let's damn, damn bro. Come on, man. Let's try to exercise. I when it's blame. What, what about the exercise, man? What you think about it? Yeah. <laughs> What's the exercise we playing? Yeah, the exercise. What you think about? What about it? What we just talked about? I'm listening. I'm listening to what I you're saying. Said it. Yeah, I heard it. So what you think? What do I think? I still think the same thing, man. If if if, if I is trying and and we is brought into the picture of the trying and the we don't him don't try with the I, then it's a we problem. It's back to we. We we is a problem. We we sound like I ain't trying on that. Wow. So now so and, now, and so I now, it, get the blame. so now it's his fault because we still in the same condition they in. No, it's, you can't it's speak our fault. We like this. We is only this. Well, okay then. I guess it is an our problem. It's yeah. our, okay. It it'll be an our problem. It'll be a, it'll be an individual problem amongst a lot of eyes. Come on, man. Stop that bullshit, man. You know, good and well, motherfucking damn uh, 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 power in numbers. Why are you talking that crazy shit, man? I think it makes sense. Damn. It makes sense. That's crazy. I am the and we when it's got them celebrated. I ain't got a problem with that. But still, you got a bunch of eyes and we. No, there ain't no eyes and we, nigga. I mean, ain't no eyes and you, You're right. There's not an eye and we. But sure. what I'm saying, the I, eyes, a bunch of eyes create we. <laughs> Man, really? How about we go to the bank tomorrow and see what we can get done? How about that? So what? How about I and you? <laughs> go to the bank and do what? And see what we can get done. Talk about to what? the banker. About what? Talk to him about shit. Can we get something in order to, to do what we want need to do? What we trying to do? <clears throat> we gotta discuss that before we go to the bank. A barber art gal. How we gonna sell that? How we gonna sell it? That's a great idea to me, man. Let me see, that's what I'm saying. I think we need more. You and I would need to gather more artists. How you feel about more barbers? That too. I mean, they're all artists. That's what I'm talking about. Artists, period, my dude. When I say artists, I mean artists, man. Artists. That too. All that. Because we're going to need all that. We're going to need the barbers, and we're going to need the damn painters. Or whatever, the, you know. I think I get my fucking in there, man. I mean, you... you I, I feel like you see, you see what I got in my shop. I got, I got two more stations, but can't find not one barber. Niggas, niggas don't want it. I don't know, bro. I put it out there on plenty of occasions. You can't find barbers, man. These barbers, they, they, they overnight successes. They want overnight success, bro. They want to be down rich in, in a week with this shit. That, but it. But the but the nothing runs like that unless you're born into this shit. You got something wrong with me? You know what's up? They want to be overnight success, man. I mean, I done heard a lot of people <clears throat> come talk about man shit. I might be in one bar school. What's up with it? Uh, you get to telling them, telling them, you know what I'm saying, the struggle that you went through with it. Wow. Next thing you know, they stop talking about it. Are you talking about the struggle? I'm telling them about, yeah, I mean, all that come together, bro. What I went through, what I went through to them, to be able to continue. trying to talk them out of that shit. No, I don't talk them out of them. I be like, shit, this is, no, this is, shit, I like what I do. What you mean? I'll tell you that, it's all work. It ain't easy. Yeah, it ain't easy. It take work. It take work. If you're going to do it, you got to do it. You got to get out there. You got to promote. You got to sell yourself. You got to damn, and you got to be able to cut. Bottom line, it's a good thing. 
You can appreciate. It's something you can appreciate because it's something you created for yourself. You know, I'm not trying to run them from. I'm, I be, I encourage them. Shit, go do it. I got two stations right here waiting for you. I got a station waiting for you, my brother.